by the nature of trying to protect people, sometimes it is important when you have as much online power as I do to not mention certain things um, to help people because I don't want people to have problems. I don't think people should be challenged to give to charity. I think they should just give to charity. Give, and I had been giving a lot. Bob, you've got to do this. You owe them money. You've got this responsibility. You have to give to this charity. I already had given. I gave to a number of charities and I ended up being physically threatened because I was giving to charity. I made a decision to donate privately. The charity has to be a private thing from now on. I think it's important to say I donate regularly and I donate a lot, um, but it's nobody's business. I did donate. Um, and then I went and bought a PRS guitar for my son. Yeah, it's a great guitar. First of all, I own a business that deals with music, so I get good tax breaks on gear. And secondly, I demonstrate for the biggest online musical merchants on the planet. I get a really good discount. Yes, Forbes featured me. Yes, I have money. I've worked really hard. I believe in myself. I've never stopped. Um, my channel is doing great. In fact, it's on the rise, not on the decline. <laughs> he starts by saying that I don't have a degree from Water Bear. I don't need one. <laughs> I'm a professional musician. I don't make my living from selling music, but the money I make from selling music could be my living. Uh, this year alone, I've been in the charts three times and I, I do fine with Clockwork Wolf and Company, with Dorje, Monkey Lord. Um, whenever I do something for charity now, I don't tell people. I'm on a charity single right now with Alice Cooper, Doug Aldrich, Justin Hawkins. Playing guitar on it, you can hear me all over it, it's in the charts. I'm a professional, so as an ambassador for Waterbear, I'm there with a wealth of experience in social media and actually physically taking the social media and turning it into a live audience. In fact, we're launching a vote at the NAM show this January, like a big vote. So there's just loads of collaboration. When you sell this many guitars, and Chapman sells a lot of guitars now, you're gonna get problems with product. Did you ever see brand owners from those companies step in to help? Did you ever see them involved in any way? because I was helping as much as I could all the time. Chapman was the only brand trying to help. We did as many, I mean, I did clinics, a lot of people went to the clinics. I did these things for free because I cared and I still care. My awesome wife decided to surprise me by running a fundraiser. I got an amazing birthday present and I bought a vocal lesson package. I run two businesses. Um, I have five musical projects. I demonstrate internationally through the biggest online and physical retailers. Working hard is something that I have always done.